않을까 기대로 She just has a way, man, with music. Hearing this live is such a treat for the ears. I don't know how she does it, man. There's. 좋은 아침 여러분, 토니입니다. Good morning, everyone. It's Tony. So today, the goddess IU has decided to bless us with another special live version of one of her songs, "Being Above the Time." This time, very, very excited for this. I cannot wait. I love everything. Absolutely, IU. If you just mention her name, I will just cry tears of happiness because this is a goddess among all of us humans. She is just amazing. If you listen to her voice, she cannot go wrong. And then if you listen, just to her personality if you've seen her on any other video she's so funny she's so bubbly she's just absolutely the perfect like human being i really do think she's an angel among us so yeah guys this is going to be above the time it's actually a song that i was planning on reacting to come christmas time so that's because it has a bit of like a holiday feel but i think that this is no time than other to like react to it so without further ado guys let's get into it this is going to be a live clip of i use above the time The piano really sells it to me. Oh, I love like just the whole grandeur of it. <laughs> There's our IU looking like goddess, as she should be. Even the, the mic has crowns on it, as it should be. She just can't go wrong with a live performance by you. Oh. <sighs> so guys, there's really nothing to analyze here. This is going to be very much more for like just pure reaction because this song in particular just hits so many notes for me i just love it so much when i first came out i listened to this song on repeat and it did make me cry to a point and that's really what's happening here it's just bringing back all the memories and i think that that's something that special that iu really delivers with all of her songs there's this sense of like nostalgia kind of like emotionality that everybody can connect with and she just has a way with her music it's absolutely just amazing Oh. oh, it's so smooth. Okay, the music's a bit loud. She doesn't hold these high notes anymore she doesn't she rarely does do these high notes just purely because it does kind of like damage her voice and that's why like another song that she used to sing the high note part she no longer sings that part only on a special occasions so i think that here it's kind of like referring to the idea that this is kind of like a special occasion granted it's not that high in comparison but still super high for any other singer out there if you really think about it so i really do appreciate that she's kind of like going out of her way to do this like clip for everybody Oh. Here's the blue flowers. See, like it goes from like a sad tone to this, but then she somehow manages to pick it back up and kind of like brains it. It just, she just has a way, man, with music. Like, there's no way she's hurt the age she is. She looks like she's like permanently 23, man. And she's so beautiful.
I hit the wrong button. We have to get back to it. But that was a lot of a hot, longer of a higher note than I remember it being. I really don't remember it being that long in the song. Jeez, man. Yo, she still got it after all this time. Literally going from high note to high note to high note. Like, she doesn't sound exhausted at all, and that's just how amazing and professional she is, how much of a master she is. It's just really insane. Hearing this live is such a treat for the years. <laughs> I like this like piano part here, like adds a bit of something. A lot of violins. And then like a kind of like a folky type of vibe here. This part of the song really caught me off guard, but the transition into what's to come next is so clean and I like the addition here because it kind of brightens it up the mood and everything and just allows us to like catch a second just like kind of regroup ourselves. I love the addition of like kind of like opera voices too. It just makes it so much more grand. It just feels kind of like fairy tale esque at a point. It's so magical. I love you so much. I think she changed. She's like Elsa now, and then like Frozen, it's like, boom! And she's like, yeah, look at me now! I don't know how she does it, man. There's so many high notes in this song and it's just insane how she hasn't been able to like let go of it. It just like has kept on going and you don't hear any sign of fatigue or whatsoever. It's just the amazingness that is her Ayu. Mm. Well, that's a cool like effect. Yeah, no. <laughs> it makes me cry. But I won't cry. It's a happy tears. I love when it comes back, just what we had in the intro. She looks so elegant. It's like the end of like a theater almost. Boom. Wow, 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 wow. I you definitely did not disappoint, although she never does. It's amazing. This entire song was absolutely just perfect. This live performance of it was absolutely so magical. I really can't say anything more because you can't critique perfection. You can't critique the goddess herself. She just absolutely killed it on so many levels. This live performance gave me so much more respect for just how many high notes she can hit and just how well this and how difficult this song is for anybody but her to perform. I knew it going into it, but it's been a little bit of a while since I last listened to the song and this just brought it all back to me. This is just absolutely amazing and I think it's a great treat that she released this for us. I really cannot say anything more, guys. I hope you do check out 
more of IU stuff if you haven't been already blessed by listening to the goddess herself. If you do want to check out though, I also do have some IU reactions on the channel. I'll leave them all linked in the IU playlist down in the description box below. Hopefully you give them a check out. But with that being said, guys, hopefully you did enjoy this video. Thank you so much for watching. Kamsamida. And as always, if you have any comments, questions, or something you want to talk, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. And I'll get to it as soon as possible. With that being said, guys, this has been Tony. Annyeonghaseyo. Goodbye. And I'll see you in the next video.